hi guys and welcome back to a new tutorial hope everybody is doing well today's uh, tutorial is gonna be a stitch or a pattern which I wanted to uh, make for a long time which is the waffle stitch so if you're interested to see how to achieve this waffle stitch stay tuned for so as usual to start with we'll make the magic circle and just to just a reminder this uh, tutorial is only a demonstration on how to do the waffle stitch it's not a real project uh, if you're planning to make a blanket or a pillowcase or whichever project then you'll have to chain as many as you need for your uh, own project for now I'm chaining around 22 and once I'm done with that I'm gonna double crochet in each stitch so the project starts with a number of chain then double crochet in each stitch now we are done with <coughs> with a double crochet row and we will start our next row where we will see how to start making the waffle stitch so now we will chain three and we turn Now instead of working double crochet in each stitch uh, as the normal uh, double crochet stitch work we will work inside or in between the double crochet like you see now you insert your hook and you continue working your double crochet you're basically making a front post stitch for the next two stitches we will make a normal double crochet like you see now <coughs> now again we will make the front post stitch by yarning over and working in between the previous double crochet like you see now and then again you'll work two double crochet in each one double crochet in each of the next two stitches so basically this row is one front post stitch then two normal double crochet one front post stitch and two normal double crochet until the end of the row where you will make here a double crochet stitch before you turn So this is the first row completed. To make a recap, what you need to do is chain 3 from the beginning and then start the uh, front post stitch crochet by, uh, by yarning over 
uh, inserting your hook in between the next double crochet stitch and then working your usual double crochet for the next two stitches you'll make one double crochet each so now we'll start the next row again we'll chain three and this time it will be the opposite of what we worked earlier so now what was the uh, front post stitch on the previous row will be a normal double crochet stitch like you see now will work a normal double crochet stitch not a front post now you remember we did on the previous row two normal double crochet stitches now they are becoming the front uh, post stitch the front post yeah double crochet stitch and the previous front post crochet stitch will be a normal one like you see what I'm doing now so to keep up with each row you what you need to remember is uh, whenever you have front post uh, crochet stitch in the previous row you do a normal double crochet on the next row and what was a normal double crochet becomes the front uh, post stitch on the next row I hope this tutorial uh, was clear and easy to follow uh, if you have any question about uh, how uh, to go further on uh, each row please do not hesitate to ask in the comments section if you like the video make sure you are subscribed uh, to see more, more projects uh, in the future until next time you take care bye bye